In the freezing weather, Mike Stevens reminds us there is beauty in the winter season. In 2004, he traveled to Wayne County on a particularly cold day to look for the bright side. He shows us what he found in tonight's trip back down the Pennsylvania Road. So a friend said to me this morning, off to do another beauty of winter story? Of course, I answered, for what else is there to do? As it is, I long for a temperature reading above 32 degrees. There is winter everywhere I go. There seems no escaping it. Icicles, the gauge of how deep winter is. What is a lowly reporter to do, dear viewer, than to venture out to capture brighter moments wherever they might be found? In that, I am a man grasping at straws on a cold sea of white. We had some fun, photographer Paul Kilbasa and I, watching some horses in a pasture spending their day. This place near Lake Ariel is cold and windy, yet they found it quite to their liking. Horses, it seems, are not bothered by, nor concerned with, what we think of as an awful day. Billy Pauly probably has that same attitude. He didn't stop long enough for me to ask. His grandfather gave him some get up and go when he needed it, otherwise Billy did just fine. He had one of those old sleds. It had metal runners, wood slats, pretty good steering, and it could go. That one would put the wind in your face. We chanced by Hollisterville Creek, hard by Pond Road, where it cuts off 690. You know the spot. Good trout stream, one fella told me, in spring and summer. Now it was but a small gray ribbon surrounded by a white blanket. It still sounded just fine, I thought. The world out here isn't that great this time of year. You need to take whatever good you can find whenever you find it. Mike Stevens, Newswatch 16 on the Pennsylvania Road in Wayne County.